Hello everyone, today I am here to review the LED motion sensor light. When you order it, it'll come in this very nice compact box, very well packaged. Opening it up, let's go ahead and take out the items inside here. You can see here that it does come with a few things. Looks like here are the lights themselves. In total, there are six of them. And then it does come with that very nice charging stand as well. Lastly, it does come with the cable to charge the items, a remote to use, and a user manual. We're gonna go over how to use everything today, so I don't think you'll need the instruction manual too much, but if you do need it, it is there available. Let's start with the uh, storable multi-device charging station. So as you can see here, it does allow for three devices to be charged at once, as well as a little carrying container for the remote as well. This does have a built-in battery, so what you can do is you can take your charging cable, if you do need to charge this, plug it into your outlet, then plug into the device. You'll see that there is a uh, green light that turns on there, but it does have that built-in 1000 milliamp rechargeable battery, which can be used for 10 to 20 days in adduction mode after it's been fully charged. It can charge up to three of these lights up to full battery once it's been disconnected. So now that this is charged, good to go. I can take this with me and I can charge up to three at any given time before this needs a recharge. This is great in helping keep your desk nice and neat and tidy because you can store all these things very compactly onto this. It also has the four non-slip pads at the bottom here to ensure that this isn't gonna slide around regardless of the surface that it sits on. To give you a closer look at these lights, as you can see here, you do have the light all across the front. On the sides here, you do have two buttons. One is for the brightness, and then the other one is to turn it on and then change the different modes. And on the back here, you do have this um, sticky panel if you do wanna apply this to the wall. For example, I'm gonna put mine in the hallway. We'll go through that later. Um, but I'm gonna set this up in my hallway so that way it turns on when I'm walking through the hallway. But uh, just to show you how it works, go ahead and click and hold the power button for three seconds. And you'll see that the light does turn on. And then there was a light in the center there that changes color. So that green mode is night mode, blue light is day mode, and then the red light is the always on mode. And you can read those instructions right on the side here. So now that it's on though, you can click the button to change brightness. So you can see that with each press. It is varying in brightness. And again, that's completely up to you to set uh, for each individual light. Each light can be configured in their own way. Another piece that comes with this is that remote control. So as you can see here on the remote control, you can do a lot of the same functions that you can with the buttons on the side of the lights, but you can also set time increments too, which is unique to the remote. So you can see at the bottom part there, you can set between 10, 30, 60, and 120 minutes that the light will stay on. So like we mentioned earlier, there are two different modes. So if I turn this on, you see the green light, that means that it is in night mode. So night mode is great for at night, walking through the hallway, you want certain lights to turn on. This will pick up within 10 feet of any motion of a human, turn on for 15 seconds, and then turn back off once it doesn't detect any motion again. So again, perfect for um, lighting up dark areas, and making sure that you save battery in the long term because it automatically turns itself off. Overall, these lights are very easy to install. You have two different ways. One is using the strip here, which I take off the sticky portion, and then I can just apply it directly to the wall. So that way, whenever I need to charge it, I can just pull it off the wall there, and the sticky portion will stay on. The other way is with the built-in strong magnet. So you can easily attach it to, for example, under the cabinet with any iron product. But for me, for my uh, setup in the hallway, I just went ahead and used the adhesive tape to apply to any flat surface. So you can see here, I am using that remote just to turn them off, turn them on. I change the brightness. I set them all to the blue mode, and then I set them all finally to the night mode. And you can watch slowly one by one as they turn off because they are no longer detecting human motion. Overall, these work great in many different instances. And as you can see here, they work great for me in my hallway. So I would recommend getting one for yourself today.